Which video is AI? Test yourself now, and then I'll tell you all the ways you can spot it in just a minute. But if that's hard, let's zoom in. We'll do it again. But if you already got it, go even further and try to guess the process we used to make this. All right, let's lay it out. The first three seconds are exactly the same. Then we split up reality. We asked the AI to generate a car crash with this prompt. The secret was detecting that switch by spotting the differences between the before and after. The AI version is softer and it jumbles up textures. It rearranged the sidewalk tiles. It actually stopped the rain completely when it switched over and the contrast and shadows become less strong. Then there were movement problems, like how the action down the street, where things were smaller, stopped completely and very suddenly. I think it is incredible that the AI version inferred the correct speed of the bus and this car based on motion blur and context alone. Remember, I just gave it a single frame, that's crazy, but it didn't figure that out for the things that were farther away. Then the car appeared to slide and drift before it hit the bus, and since the AI can't match the wheel angle and car direction, that's where that comes from. And finally, the collision looked realistic, but there was no damage to the car or bus, which was kind of surprising. You will never get a side-by-side -side in real life though, so Detecting those differences alone and in isolation is important to learn, and that just takes practice. Follow for more.